The fall armyworm is an aggressive pest affecting crops across Africa. Farmers have experienced losses as maize and other plants are attacked by these caterpillars. Many farmers have resorted to the use of chemical pesticides as a main way to manage this pest. Improper use of pesticides have unwanted effects on agricultural production, health and the environment. Before resorting to pesticides, farmers should aim to prevent this pest through timely planting, regular weeding and removal of crop residues after harvest. Keep your crop healthy. Plant seeds recommended for your region. Use the right fertilizer and practice crop rotation. Monitor your farm for pests at least once a week. Pick five randomly selected sites and look for damage on 10 consecutive plants in one row. Manage small and early infestations by handpicking the caterpillars or using biological insecticides and biopesticides registered for the management of the fall armyworm. Liaise with your extension or refer to the Pest Control Products Board website listing for information. We've registered a number of biopesticides and other alternatives that farmers can use. To give the farmers the information, this information of the products that have been registered are available free of charge on our website where they can access and see what alternatives they have for the control of the pests. So they don't have to use the conventional chemicals as a first result. should come last at the end. Chemical pesticides should be used as a last option in pest management. Always follow instructions on the product's label to reduce risks to health and the environment. At purchase, buy pesticides from a registered agro-dealer. Refer to the Pest Control Products Board listing of registered agro-dealers. Obtain a receipt for your purchase to help trace the dealer in the event of fake pesticides. Check the product label for the product registration number provided by the Pest Control Products Board registration number PCPB in brackets R stroke P expiry date ensuring it is fit for use the active ingredient stated on the label seek advice from your extension officer on the appropriate active ingredient to help manage the fall armyworm check the label for color codes to guide on harmfulness chemicals with green bands are the safest to use followed by those with blue bands yellow color denotes harmful products and the red bands indicate high toxicity to health or a hazard to the environment. Product packaging should be intact, with proper seals not leaking and they should not have been tampered with. Buy only the required quantities of pesticide. Calculate beforehand the amount needed to avoid being left with a surplus that necessitates storage or waste. After purchase, read and follow instructions on the label for storage of the pesticide. Store pesticides in their original containers as they are made strong enough to withstand the chemical. Retain the label for future reference. Store them in places designated for that purpose and away from children and the elderly and away from all food, animal feed and flames. Dispose of pesticide containers in designated places. Things to remember. Prevent infestation as a first step in the management of the fall armyworm. Detect and manage early infestations through weekly scouting and the use of biological insecticides and biopesticides. If using chemical pesticides, buy a product recommended by your agricultural expert and strictly follow the instructions on the label. Happy farming!